So Owen Jones has cancelled his membership to the Labour Party. Now this is a man who's been a member of the Labour Party since he was 15 and he can no longer handle the Labour Party going back on its pledges one after another, rolling back, rolling back, rolling back and its position on Gaza. I share a similar story to him. I was a Labour member since I was 18. I left the Labour Party shortly after Keir Starmer got in. It was, funnily enough, it was actually during Ramadan. Every year the Labour Party leader sits down with a group of people in London uh, for an iftar and because there were some Palestine supporters within that iftar meeting, um, Keir Starmer refused to go and sit down and have food with them. I mean, even this was a virtual iftar, it wasn't a physical one, but he refused to sit down with them simply because they were Palestine supporters. And I knew then that I could never stand with a man who has that much contempt for Muslims. He campaigned to become the Labour Party leader on a number of pledges. He's back, he's broken every single one of his campaign pledges. And now he's pitching himself as a right-wing party. He's trying to present himself as a new Tony Blair. He doesn't have the vision of Tony Blair. He doesn't have the charisma of Tony Blair. And he, for, and, and he doesn't have the money that Tony Blair inherited when he came into power. So the Labour Party under Keir Starmer is going to fail massively and who's going to benefit is going to be the right wing parties that benefit unless we provide them with a credible alternative. Now the Greens have been providing a credible alternative for a very long time that's why I joined the Greens three or four years ago and that's why I've been campaigning hard for Gipton and Hare Hills. I've built up a good foundation in the area and this is the year that we're going to break through inshallah this is the year that we're going to make a change for the community because our community has been neglected, our community has been failed uh, by the Labour Party and the Labour councillors. This is the year that we're going to make a true grassroots movement that's going to make a change for the community.